A campaign by TikTok to call on users to contact their representatives in Congress appears to have backfired. Here's what's going on. There's a new push in Washington that could impact the app, potentially banning it. Lawmakers are aiming to go after TikTok's parent company. Members of the House are pushing a bill that would force ByteDance to sell the app. The move comes amid concerns about the potential national security risks associated with user data collected by TikTok. The bill has significant bipartisan support with unanimous approval from the Energy and Commerce Committee. Now the bill heads to the full House and could be voted on as soon as next week. In response, TikTok launched a campaign within the app warning users of a potential ban that could harm businesses and creators. The app directed users to contact their representatives in Congress to oppose the bill. Congressional offices were overwhelmed with phone calls. The authors of the bill responded furiously, calling it a massive propaganda campaign, emphasizing TikTok would not be banned if ByteDance divests its ownership. Lawmakers say TikTok is misleading users by calling it a ban. The Biden administration has signaled support for the bill while also engaging with TikTok. President Biden has even used the platform as part of his re-election campaign. Now, this isn't the first attempt to address security concerns surrounding the app. Similar efforts were made under the Trump administration. The debate highlights the complex relationship between American tech users and companies with ties to foreign governments. Whether the bill passes and how the president addresses these concerns remains to be seen.